Brain fart. Brain fart. A brief mental lapse, especially an instance of forgetfulness or confusion. I can't remember what I wanted to ask you. I just had a brain fart. I had a brief brain fart and introduced him by the wrong name. Itchy feet. Itchy feet. Restless desire to travel. The trip gave me itchy feet, and I wanted to travel more. I always get itchy feet in the summer. Keep your chin up. To stay cheerful and hopeful during difficult times. He is still keeping his chin up despite all his health problems. Keep your chin up. Everything will work out for the best. On the tip of my tongue. Almost able to remembered, recalled. I know her, her name is on the tip of my tongue, but it won't come. I had the answer on the tip of my tongue, but couldn't think of it in time. Break a leg. Used to wish someone good luck. I know you can do it. Good luck. I hope you break a leg at your job interview tomorrow. Like pulling teeth. Very difficult and frustrating. Getting him to do his homework is like pulling teeth. Getting my children to eat vegetables is like pulling teeth. Achilles heel. A weak point or fault in someone or something, otherwise perfect or excellent. He is good at all subjects except mathematics. Math is his Achilles heel. Speaking English fluently has always been his Achilles heel. A bundle of nerves. Someone who is extremely nervous or worried. Sorry for shouting. I'm a bundle of nerves these days. Since she lost her job, Rosie has been a bundle of nerves. Wet behind the ears. Either very young or inexperienced. When she started the job, she was still wet behind the ears. He is too wet behind the ears to bear such responsibilities. Cold shoulder. To deliberately ignore someone in an unfriendly way. I was so upset that he gave me the cold shoulder. I tried to be pleasant to her, but she gave me cold shoulder.
head over heels. Completely in love with someone. Mary is head over heels with Sam. She has fallen head over heels in love with her boss. Pick someone's brain. To ask someone who knows a lot about a subject for information or their opinions. I was picking his brain about which one to buy. I need some ideas for my presentation. Can I pick your brain? Pour your heart out. To tell someone everything you are thinking and feeling. She sat down and poured her heart out about the divorce. The woman is pouring her heart out to her friends. Butterflies in my stomach. To be nervous or excited about something. I had butterflies in my stomach before my exam. I have butterflies in my stomach because today is my first day at work. Kick back. To lean back and relax, chill out. It is time to kick back and enjoy life. I like to kick back and relax on my chair with a cup of coffee. Turn a blind eye. To ignore something. To pretend that one does not notice something. I'm going to turn a blind eye this time, but don't let it happen again. As a manager, I cannot turn a blind eye to the problems of your customers. Zip your lip. Stop talking, close your mouth and be quiet. Why don't you just zip your lip? I'm tired of listening to you. Zip your lip. You are talking too much. Rack your brain. To try hard to remember something or think of a solution to a problem. I racked my brain, trying to remember his name. I racked my brain, but couldn't find solution to the problem. Apple of my eye. Something or someone that one likes very much. You are an apple of my eye. Linda is an apple of his grandparents' eyes. In the blink of an eye. Very quickly. The car disappeared in the blink of an eye. The sun disappeared in the blink of an eye and started rain. Sweet tooth. A love for sugary foods. My son has a very big sweet tooth. Always eats a lot of chocolate.
I have a sweet tooth. Keep an eye on. To watch someone or something carefully. To be attentive to someone or something. Keep an eye on the baby while I make dinner. You should keep an eye on the ball. Pull one's leg. To tease or trick someone in a fun, playful way. To joke. I love pulling my sister's leg. It is almost easy to annoy her. He was pulling my leg when he told me he lost my phone. Cost an arm and leg. To be very expensive. This dress is lovely, but it cost me an arm and leg. The meals cost an arm and leg in this restaurant. See eye to eye. To agree with someone. To have similar viewpoint or opinions with someone. I don't see eye to eye with my wife. Do you always see eye to eye with your friends? A pain in the neck. Someone or something that is very annoying or difficult to deal with. That child is a real pain in the neck. These mosquitoes are such pain in the neck. Eat your heart out. To be jealous over someone else's accomplishments or good luck. The reward money is mine. Eat your heart out. Eat your heart out. I bought a new car. Make one's blood boil. To make someone very angry. When I hear people gossip about others, it makes me blood boil. My blood boiled when he called me a thief. A sight for sore eyes. A person or thing that you are extremely pleased or relieved to. My darling, you are a sight for sore eyes. The garden with its many trees and flowers is always a sight for sore eyes. Follow your nose. Move forward. To trust one's instincts. Turn left. Then just follow your nose and you'll see the shop. Take a chance and follow your nose. You may be right. Cry your heart out. To cry a lot. I threw myself onto the bed and cried my heart out. She flung herself at his chest and sobbed her heart out. Get off my back. It means you want someone to stop criticizing you and leave you alone. 
Why don't you get off my back? I'm doing my best. Please get off my back. I've had enough of you. Flesh and blood. One's family members. I must help my brother and sister because they are my own flesh and blood. I can't believe my own flesh and blood would betray me like this. Cold feet To lose courage to do something because of having fear or anxiety. He was going to ask her for a date L, but he got cold feet. He got cold feet at the last minute. All ears. Ready to listen attentively. Tell me everything what happened to her. I'm all ears. The children were all ears when Granny told them stories. Old Hand One who is experienced and skilled in a particular area of activity. I'm an old hand at this game. He is old hand at fencing. Eye catching. Very attractive or noticeable. I love to dress in expensive, eye catching clothes. They packaged their candy in eye catching wrappers. Give a hand. To help someone with something. I'm so glad you gave me a hand with cleaning. She lend me a hand. To go belly up. To fail or go bankrupt. This company is about to go belly up. The whole program went belly up. Break your back. To work extremely hard. She broke her back to get the report finished on time. I broke my back to achieve my goals.